hello, this is the third video about the game I'm trying to make. Um, I don't have a whole lot to show this week because I've been working on a bunch of different things which don't really... Um, not really showable. You can hear one of them which is a bit of music that I've been working on. Um, I'll talk a little bit about that but um, first here's, here's what I do have to show. So this is the the starting environment of the game. It's where you will begin, I think. It's this room. And uh, I've been spending quite a lot of time working on this, largely because I've had a lot of problems with texturing and materials and things. It's a process which I don't really understand and I'm learning as I go. But uh, we've kind of more or less got the environment done now. Um, I haven't been incredibly meticulous with these things, so I don't know how much these things are important, but the the grain of this wood is stretched a bit too much. Uh, the, the planks on the ceiling don't line up, and uh, maybe I should be being more meticulous about these things, but I'm not. We'll see. Um, another thing that I've been doing this last week has been making a bunch of uh, two-dimensional artwork paintings and things to go on the walls. This is one of them. Abstract uh, painting-y thing. So yeah, everything outside is is much more unfinished. I've been doing a bunch on the wall. Um, but the other thing I've spent quite a lot of time on and have failed at largely are these steps, or not specifically these steps, but the the method by which you'll get down to ground level. And I want something... Uh, it's just some steps, right? Maybe I'm uh, obsessing over it a bit too much. But I want something where you will uh, descend from the room down into the, the level where most of the game will take place. And I want you to sort of survey it as you do so. So my idea is that the, the steps will take you uh, through the different angles. You can look at this thing. So you, you come down and you see it from one angle. And then you turn and you see this angle. It takes you back around and makes you scan all the way around. And then finally it takes you to look at the other angle as well and you'll you'll come finish off here pointing in this direction hopefully ready to go look at whatever will be over here and um, the current arrangement that I've got does that it's a bit difficult to see because there's the white is, is too bright um, but but I also want it to feel like a real part of the the building of the architecture and right now it doesn't it's a, it's a big block which is not even attached to the the wall and i haven't found a way to uh to build the steps how i want them um but also integrated into the building it doesn't help that i've i've made every floor of the building a bit smaller than the last one uh, this is probably iteration number 5 on the stairs and uh, I still don't like them, so back to the drawing board probably. Um, and that's that's pretty much everything I have to show. Uh, a little bit about the music, so I've started writing music for the piece, which you heard at the beginning and can probably still hear. Um, it's made up of a bunch of, well, almost exclusively out of samples from a what I believe is a kora, a West African musical instrument. I found one in the street, almost completely destroyed and totally disgusting and unplayable really, but have, um, I don't know, got some sounds out of it. And uh, that's, that's what you can hear, along with some uh, very musical sounding enamel storage jars that we, we picked up for the kitchen. And uh, that's that's the music that I've been working on. Uh, that's pretty much it. Toodley.